these people have some serious genius level IQ. They figured a way to beat the system at its own game. This kid could rob a bank in broad daylight without getting caught because he understands the power of acting casually. This guy's found the perfect way to create that real brick effect, except his friends are gonna call him Spider-Man for the rest of his life. Hoverboards should be marketed as gardening tools, and this dude should be the face of the brand because he makes mowing the lawn look quick and easy. Moses may have parted the Red Sea, but look at this guy who can separate puddles with a leaf blower. Some people call this peak laziness. I call it the ultimate in grape-to-mouth delivery. Same thing, really. Tasty. When you want to avoid mowing the lawn so badly, you borrow crop circle technology from some aliens. This man's a genius for working out how to use a treadmill to get less exercise. I think Jesse Pinkman said it best when he said, Magnet! Oh! Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Some people make their life easier using high-tech gadgets, but all this guy needs is one piece of string and he'll never need to take the trash out again. If you can remove this gold bar from the box, it's yours. But there's a catch. It requires the hand strength and dexterity of a Shaolin warrior. And believe it or not, 99% of people fail. This guy really doesn't want to get his hands dirty, and thanks to this digger, he doesn't need to. The Superman may be an illegal move in professional cycling, but it's definitely a way to hack physics to your advantage. Never unpack the milk again when you can pull off this move, though if I tried it, I'd cause the great milk flood of 2023. They say men can't multitask, but this guy can work and exercise at the same time. You are watching a master. Some put their peak in the front, some put it in the back, and this kid puts it everywhere. Never underestimate an old man's abilities. It might not be safe, but he's probably been doing this for years. Father of the Year award goes to this guy. He's discovered a way to have fun with the kids without lifting a muscle. Get over here! When he said he could catch salmon in his sleep, no one believed him. No snowplow? <laughs> no problem. This guy mounted a TV box to his ride-on mower and got the job done anyway. It turns out there's a use for your leaf blower, even when there's no leaves around. And modern problems require modern solutions. Once this dude had two hobbies, chopping wood and biking, but then he invented this. Talk about time management. This guy has the skills to turn a bad situation around, and I think it's flipping awesome. The Amish may not have any technology, but they make up for it with teamwork and great fashion sense, of course. This distinguished gentleman's method of feeding himself chips really sucks, but in the best way possible. Nice. With his claw machine hacking skills, this guy's making sure he never has to buy his girlfriend a present ever again. When you gotta chop a lot of wood and you're short on time, introducing the triple axe. Same swing, three times the firewood. If you want to get your kid working around the yard, just attach a leaf blower to an RC car. Problem solved. That's one way to get ahead of your competitors. Something tells me that this trick's going straight over their heads. This guy doesn't have the world's best ball skills, but he has the perfect skills to be a baller. Hey, baby. That green cushion deserves a raise and a promotion for all the hard work it's doing. Whoever put it there should become this company's new CEO. Why this kid isn't a millionaire yet is beyond me. We could all do with one of these in our lives. Nice. Why risk life and limb cleaning a building's exterior when you can have a drone do it for you? It cleans everything in its path, cameras included. This guy wanted to know exactly how this girl got so lucky. Who needs luck when you've got magnets? In this human claw machine game, you get one chance to grab as many packets as possible in one go. These people had a strategy, and it paid off. Modern problems require modern solutions. Why lay bricks when you can just create this instant brick effect with, um, <laughs> whatever this thing's called? Chopping wood into perfect pieces has never been faster. Why row your boat gently down the stream when you can pedal with this thing? Bye, have a great time. This guy is the definition of working hard or hardly working. When you cross your local gardener with Mad Max, this is the end result. At least he gets around fast enough. 
people have discovered a way to party all night without any noise complaints, unless someone calls the cops about that squeaky floor. Instead of taking his kid to the fair, this dad spent the money on this crate instead. It looks almost as fun as the real thing. Booyah! True time management is training for a hockey match and getting the mopping done at the same time. Part dance routine, part health and safety hazard, this worker found an interesting way to unload a massive stack of PVC pipes. Who has time to walk and blow long clippings? Not this guy. He's the very definition of work smarter, not harder. This guy doesn't need the gym. His muscles are entirely down to his insane french fry making skills. Who says fries make you fat? When DIY meets maximum efficiency, you get the ultimate redneck invention. Nothing to see here. Just a guy who turned his car into a lawnmower. You've arrived at your destination. You know you're a boss when you discover bait that makes two fish fight over who gets to be eaten by you. First time I've ever done that. Next time you need to sand a ceiling, just make your own automatic ceiling sander. Like this guy who's never looked back because he can't with so much dust in his eyes. If you ever want to have the seat next to you empty, this guy has a trick. Just be super weird about having company and people will leave you alone. Stopping the timer at 991 wins you a brand new car, but for the ultimate clout chase, hit it with a parkour backflip kick off the wall. Oh my god, bro. Oh, hell no, man. What the this is how a whole team of snowplows clear an entire highway right before rush hour. With skills like these, I hope he's getting a job promotion. Even though electric vehicles are all the rage right now, spare a thought for this twin turbo wind powered bike powered by four leaf blowers. Give it up for the amazing, the incredible Mr. Umbrella, who should be the CEO of a major company with these problem solving skills. A true Zen master gets maximum results from minimum effort, so flipping 14 sausages at once is boss level Zen. Teamwork makes the dream work, especially if the dream's to clean escalator glass in record time. Oh, yeah. Mowing the lawn is only a chore without this thing. With this, it's a glide in the park. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Who said a broken arm was a disadvantage? If your plastic chairs look worn and dirty, just grab a big old blowtorch and torch them clean. Just don't do the same thing to worn and dirty looking people. Hang for 100 seconds, win $100. With a solid method in place, that's what I like to call the old switcheroo. This homemade floor stripper looks like so much fun, I wanna try it too. Work smarter, not harder is this kid's philosophy, and he's definitely going places on that hoverboard. He was today years old when he discovered graders go up and down. Simple, yet effective. I can do this. If you teach a man to fish, he'll be able to stay in his chair relaxing while his kids play ball. When you ride this low, you don't need to worry about a parking ticket, although judging by the car, I bet the driver could afford it. I am a super he bends for no one because the elements are his friend and the wind is on his side. Synchronized shoveling is a small sport, but it's looking for recognition on the world stage. What begins as a pretty cool piece of wooden wall art suddenly transforms into the most space-saving hack of all time. When removing the excess snow off your roof becomes oddly satisfying. This is clever, but we do think maybe that cat needs to be paid for his work. <laughs> Who needs Edward Scissorhands when you've got Jorge genius brains? This should be the only way to trim a hedge. An apple a day keeps the doctor away, and when you peel it with a drill, it'll keep everyone else away too. Before she got a job on the ship, she was a cowgirl, and with lasso skills like that, I think we should call her Ted. Say goodbye to burnt pizza forever. All you need is a disc sander and a steady hand, and no one will know that you're a terrible cook. 